My name's Amy McMeekin. I am service lead for the Life Rooms across Liverpool and Sefton. It's open to everyone. It's a health and wellbeing service focused around reducing health inequalities and barriers to access, particularly around the social determinants of health. My name is Andy Litchfield and my job role at the Life Rooms is community inclusion lead, identifying what the social needs are in that area, whether that's our pathway service for social prescribing or whether that's our, our learning offer through the Life Rooms as well. It's my job to see what the needs are and then help the support of mobilisation of services. So my name's Sean Masterson. Um, I started coming here, it was about 2018, I was about 28. I was a carer for my granddad. I was looking after him for about 10 years. And then when he passed away, like um, my depression got really bad. You know, I was contemplating suicide a lot. And uh, I just basically didn't have anything to live for anymore, really. That, that was what was always in the back of my mind. I just thought that that's my life finished now. That's all it's leading up to be. I think the unique thing about the service is the fact that Anyone can access it whenever they want and they can access it for an hour or they can come back every week for the rest of their life. The first time I come in and spoke to Wayne, he told me about the recovery college. I looked at the timetable and I was like, this is really good. Like I can see myself doing some of this stuff. So I put myself down for the anxiety courses, understanding it, managing it. Same with depression, understanding depression managing depression. We do try and promote transition and uh, moving, you know, not a dependency on services, but at the same time, if that's what someone needs and that's, you know, that is their potential, then absolutely we'll, we'll support that. Maybe like a sort of state of despair, just the distressed, worried, anxious, sad, getting them from that point empowering them and then seeing that kind of smile on the face and seeing that, that change from when they come in through through our doors and then once they're leaving. There's no better feeling than that, than that I think, just seeing that change and that, that we've been able to make that difference. I think I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for Life Rooms. It's dramatic, but it's true. Um, if I didn't be have here, I don't know what I would have done. Probably like a drugs or alcohol or something. But having the Life Rooms here and what it did for me changed my life completely.